When cast iron has become just too heavy for you, what is your best alternative? Hi, I'm Jed, this is Cook Culture. So this is a really simple question that I get all the time. Hey, you promote cast iron, you tell me to use cast iron, it's the best, weight equals best quality cookware, but my wrists, my forearms, my whichever, hurts or is sore or I've got arthritis, I need a better solution than what you're telling me that I need. And I get that. I, we deal with customers all the time that they pick up a cast iron pan and like the American style stubby little handle, it's just way too heavy. And the tiny little handle helpers that come on most cast iron are too small and they're just awkward. And I, I get that, I understand that. So what's the best alternative? I promote weight as the best factor for choosing quality cookware. If you're in a store, pick it up. If it's heavy, you're probably leaning towards good quality cookware. But if weight is the problem, what do you do? There's only really one good answer, and that comes to stainless steel. So in a really high quality aluminum core stainless steel fry pan is going to give you the same type or maybe even better performance as cast iron, but you need to be more careful on how you use it. It'll heat up fast and it will cool quickly. It, it varies in temperature a lot more and it will absorb the heat through it really quickly because you know, even a, a less expensive pan has even less aluminum or whatever the, the uh, absorbent material in the middle is and that heat transfer is very quick. So I highly suggest using stainless steel. A five ply, that means that you've got three different layers of aluminum, aluminum alloy in the center sandwiched by stainless steel on the inside and outside is my highest rated suggestion to you. Brand doesn't matter so much. If it's a five ply, you're probably dealing with a good quality brand and a good quality cookware. There aren't a lot of inexpensive, what I've ever seen, crappy five ply cookware. So if you can afford a five ply, find something that is uh, you know, within your budget and it's five ply, you're gonna be in a, a, a good space. You're gonna get a, a good quality to a high quality pan and it's gonna work very well for you. So I've got a link in the description below of a how to use stainless steel cookware video. It helps you understand what the right point of temperature and how you can understand the temperature of your surface so it's easier to cook. Where cooking with cast iron, once it's at temperature, it regulates really easily and it just kind of sits there and it's easy to cook. Putting in colder foods doesn't vary the temperature as much and so it's easier to cook with cast iron generally, uh, once you learn how to season it that is, but a high quality uh, aluminum core stainless steel pan is gonna give you everything you want. From five ply, you can go up to seven ply. So this is the Atlantis Pro Line from DeMeyer. It's seven ply. You start to get into the weight of cast iron though. It does have a much longer handle and it is more comfortable to pick up. So you know if budget allows and if the weight works for you, then go for a seven ply. Uh, you know, Atlantis Pro Line is my top rated choice when it comes to stainless steel. And that's going to give you the, the cast iron type results in a stainless steel. But I do run into the weight problem with seven ply often. So five ply, I'm a big fan. Three ply can be okay. I have found that most of the major brands over the last 20 or 30 years, it seems that their three plies have gotten thinner and lighter and it just gets a little tougher. When you're dealing with really light cookware, it's harder to maintain a perfect temperature. The, the food that you put in, if it's not all room temperature or pre-warmed, it'll change the temperature surface uh, of the pan quickly and it creates either sticking and burning and just problems. So that's why I highly recommend heavy cookware or heavy as you can feel that you can deal with. Uh, it just helps hold that heat really well and doesn't get pushed around by the food that you put in it. So stainless steel, if you have any wrist, arm, mobility issues, uh, is the number one choice. So I hope this helps. Thanks so much.